Hello everybody and welcome back to Forever Sports. I'm standing here at Bordeaux Stadium and we are just a few hours away from the second Rugby World Cup clash of the current champions, the Springboks, taking on Romania at 3 o'clock here in Bordeaux. We're about to head over to the uh, the fan zone and get to know all the fans, do some interviews and stuff like that. But a very quick update. There are reports coming out of the Bok camp that uh, Springbok fly half and Esther Tigers fly half, Andre Pollard, is set to replace Malcolm Marks in the squad. We saw um, this being mentioned as a possibility after it was confirmed on Thursday that Malcolm Marks has been ruled out out of the tournament and uh, since then we then saw an update that he will not be replaced just yet um, and that there are hooker options in the likes of Dion Free who has actually played there and Marco Van Staden who's currently been trained to potentially cover hooker and and after that the rumor will, mill was was very much alive as they spoke about potentially looking at this, uh, the way being uh, of getting Andre Pollard into the squad. You know, we, we had these conspiracies popping up even before the World Cup that at the first injury, Andre Pollard would be called up. And uh, Hendrik Cuneo, a very reliable source, has come out with the story that says that Andre Pollard is set to join the Springbok camp, but will not be available for Ireland selection. So it sounds like after Andre Pollard did get through um, and some minutes this past weekend, getting out of card as well, but managing to get through that game against Leicester Tigers, for Leicester Tigers against Sale, um, he will join the squad this week, is the sounds of it. We have had no confirmation. Jacques Nienaber has mentioned that he is an option, but we have had no confirmation just yet that he will be joining the squad. So we expect to get that announcement potentially as soon as today in the post-match conference uh, after the Mania game. But probably in the next couple of days, uh, once we see what the injury, potential injury toll is after the Mania game, we will then get an update on uh, probably who will be replacing Malcolm Marks, whether it will be Andre Pollard and what the situation is. I do expect him not to be feature uh, against Ireland. If if so, maybe off the bench. Um, Mani Libok has been rested today for Romania for me expected to come straight back into the starting lineup against Ireland, which uh, takes place in just under a week but we'll get confirmation on that in the next few days another interesting update a very positive update um, is that we spoke about Eben Etzebeth on Friday we spoke about the fact that his injury was potentially going to take him out of the Ireland game however there are no official reports but there are now reports coming out of the Springbok camp that he is um, progressing very well and that he is said to be available for the Ireland game that he is almost back in training. He was actually here yesterday watching uh, Samoa take on Chile and uh, the reports out of the Bok camp is that he is recovering well and uh, at this stage should feature against Ireland which is obviously a huge boost for the Springbok um, team and for the pack. To lose Malcolm Marks, one of the most important players in the squad, just a few days after you're now worrying about even Etzebe's injury was a pretty bad week for the box but now all of a sudden a bit of a boost in the fact that uh, Ibn Etzebe is recovering well. Obviously still no Malcolm Marks which is going to be a huge gap but uh, the fact that Andre Pollard could join the squad will be a little bit of a boost. It'll be interesting to see who they back, whether they do go with Pollard or whether they do continue to back Livok as we go on into the tournament and as we get off to the playoffs. Um, we will have any updates officially as they do come out. But before then, please do smash like on the video. Please do subscribe to the channel as well. All your latest news coming here from the ground here at Bordeaux. My name is Steve for Freya Sports and I'll chat to you guys soon.